It is Freedom First Friday, and today we're talking about mindfulness. Joining me now is Ted Edlick and Dave Prosser. Now, Ted is one of the founding members of the Mindfulness Institute and Mindfulness Conference. In addition, he's very active in the community and has worked with Dave Prosser, who's the Z senior vice president of Freedom First Credit Union. Welcome both of you to the show. Great Thank to have you. you. Thank you so much. I love talking about mindfulness. I attended the conference last year, part of it. Yes. And I absolutely loved it. For people who are not familiar, talk a little bit about mindfulness and what it is. Well, I think you have to uh, begin by prefacing the fact that most of us are under incredible stress. Yes. Uh, we have so many uh, decisions that are impacting our lives. Change is happening so rapidly in all areas of life. And, and really, uh, a large part of life is the mental game. You know, being able to focus on those things that you can do something about and not ruminating about the past or even imagining situations that could happen in the future and letting them take up your cognitive space. Yes. But being able to focus, pay attention to what's happening, uh, will actually lead to good emotional control, good decision making, and good performance in practically every arena. Yeah, it's hard. It, you know, it sounds simple. Just be present in the moment. It's harder to do than you may think. Absolutely, because mm -hmm. our minds are so wrapped up yes. about other things that could happen, might happen, and, uh, and also uh, problems that happen that we can't continue to ruminate about. Mm -hmm. uh, right. And yet can't, can't change. Yes, now you have an upcoming conference. This is so exciting. Okay. You know, we've had some international speakers, and, and this year is the same. We have George Mumford, and George Mumford is the author of The Mindful Athlete. And what's so exciting about George is that he's actually worked with stars like Michael Jordan, Kobe Bryant, Shaquille O'Neal oh. on the Bulls and the Lakers, mm -hmm. helping them to deal with the mental game of sports because it's not just all physical, it's not just all skill, it's how what's going on in your mind, being able to relax mm -hmm. so that your talent and your, your training actually comes forth. Interesting, okay, and then of course, it relates to finances as well. Absolutely. A lot of us make quick decisions. Or emotional decisions, uh -huh. or a lot of times we purchase something because it makes us happy. Yes. So if we can fulfill <laughs> that there. need um, you know, through mindfulness, you're maybe not making that impulse decision or just purchasing things to make yourself happy. So that, of course, is, uh, improves your finances. And, and so it does translate very well into the financial aspect of the households. Is that why you wanted to be a part of something like this? Absolutely. Um, we love the work that, that um, Ted does and been a long partner uh, with Ted for a number of years. And so it does translate um, easily into the financial edu education that Freedom First uh, supplies as well. Okay, so people want more information on this conference. Um, where can they go? There's two websites, right? Yes. The Mindfulness Conference, conference Roanoke. Roanoke. Com. And then they can go mindfulroanoke.org. Yes, and, and the event is going to be on the 27th at Mill Mountain Theater. Mm -hmm. And so they could also go through the uh, center in the square. And, uh, and look for tickets. And for look, that, and for, look that. for tickets. Okay. There'll be about 345 tickets. We expect everyone to go. Yes, yeah, so get your <laughs> tickets fast. Thank you so much, gentlemen, for being here. We thanks appreciate it. Thanks for having it. us. Natalie, right, thanks now, so much. Absolutely. Time now to pop on over to Storm TV.